Hey there, uh, today I'm playing the game Bazaar from Discovery Toys. It's a game for eight and up, and it's a, a strategy game uh, based on trading gems uh, to cover uh, merchandise cards. So I'm gonna show you how to play. It's a great game for uh, older kids and adults, uh, for anyone that loves to play games that are strategy that might be a little bit more difficult than other games, this is a good one. So here we have um, gems. We have all these colored gems. We have these uh, market boards and these um, merchandise uh, cards and a dice and a scorecard. And the, um, the object is to cover these merchandise cards and then at the end when you have the, whatever um, gems you have left, there's a, a scoring. So you don't want to have any uh, gems in, left in your hand and the less you have, the higher the score you get. So um, it's a really fun game and so I'm going to show you how to play because it's easier to learn it via playing it than just reading the directions. So um, you can see that we have all these gems and they have a uh, trade value. So as you play along, you can trade the gems you get um, based on your cards. So let's give it a try. And when it's your turn, you can roll the dice or make an exchange. Okay, so it's my turn. I'm playing by myself, so here we go. So I start out with the reds. Red. And so as you're playing along, you can say you have a red and you want to exchange. You could get a blue, green, and white. So let's so on my next turn I could do that. Since I'm playing by myself, I can go ahead and exchange that. Just to make the game this example. We got one, two, three. Okay, and then I have these cards down here that I can start to look for uh, to cover up. So like this one. Okay, so I'm going to roll again. Oh, and I got a white or a clear. Goes like this. All right. So I to cover this card here, I need a red and white. So look here. I can uh, exchange the white for a red and yellow. Okay. So put that away. And now I'm almost set for that card. I just need a clear but I exchanged it for the red and yellow. So let's get it, keep playing here and I get a blue. All right, is there any way to get, see I wanna exchange this blue for, or to get a white and then I'll have that card cleared, covered. So here we go, we got, I can exchange this blue for two white and a green. So let's go ahead and do that. And just like that, my card has been covered. <laughs> So we got, we're going to cover these gems up like this, just for the fun of it. And so, so on. And so I've covered up my cards. And so what's left is what is going to be, have a point value. So I have two left and it's a, a clear, a regular card. So they are easy. Um, middle with the st one star and then harder difficult uh, with two stars. So you can see here that I have two uh, gems left and on my scorecard since I have two uh, in my hand I'm going to get 50 points. So the per first person to get the most points uh, wins. So you really don't want to have too many gems at the end of uh, covering a card because look if you did a uh, one star or two star look how many points you get. And the the winning point value it depends on how many people are playing, but you can see here um, if you have two people, it'll be 500 um, and up from six players to 200. So you don't want to have you want to cover your cards, but not have any gems left over to get a higher point value to win. So that was a really quick game, but um, in general, it's a really good strategy game for trading. So how you can get all these different combinations and there's all these different cards and so many ways to play so it's a great game it's called bazaar and it's uh, for ages eight and up and it's from discovery toys